and perfect, Zoe. Our brand new house is finally complete. This thing looks so cool. Yeah, this is like super awesome. Well, I can't wait to go ahead and take a nice, awesome nap on my perfect green bed. And my side is purple, which is amazing. But uh, Dex, what's that behind you? Wait, what are you even talking about, Zoe? And oh my gosh, wait, that looks like the G-Man. What the heck? The G-Man? That cannot be good. We should go check it out. Okay, come on. Let's run over and... Oh, wait a second. Why is there like a huge blast door in front of this G-Man right here? I don't know, but do you think we should go inside? Yeah, we probably should go check it out. Okay, come on in. Whoa, Zoe, who in the world are these guys? I have no clue, but look, they're signs. Oh, gosh, wait, I hate raining. Let me go ahead and try to see what it says. It says, you have invaded our land. Once night comes, we will fight. You have 30 minutes until you go night, night. What in the world, Zoe? They're gonna come attack us at 30 minutes. This is not good. I can't believe they're threatening us. What are we gonna do? Oh gosh, come on, Zoe. We have to get back to our house and defend our base as fast as possible. Okay, Zoe, well, what are we even gonna build for defenses? I have no idea what even to do. The first thing we have to do is build a big wall with grass blocks. Wait, a big wall with grass blocks? That's a genius idea. Okay, so if we start building it out like this and maybe we can go like super tall in the sky, there's gonna be no way those toilets can get over it. Exactly. And grass blocks are like super powerful. Nothing can take them down. Wait, are they actually like super, super strong, Zoe? Yes, it's like one of the strongest blocks in the game. Whoa, okay, I definitely want to test this out. Let me go ahead and grab some super cool TNT and we can see if the grass block survives once I blow it up. Yeah, you can light the TNT, but nothing's gonna happen because they're super strong. Yeah, I bet you're right, Zoe. Grass blocks are super strong. The TNT is gonna do absolutely nothing to it. And oh gosh, wait, Zoe, it blew up the wall. What the heck? How did they blow up? Oh gosh, I guess we have no idea what we're doing. Maybe we should hire someone to get some help. But how can we even hire someone? Well, I'm actually really good friends with the Titan speaker, man. Maybe he'll want to come and help us out. Perfect. But how do we call him? Oh, well, there's actually some phones right next to our beds. And let's see. I don't want to use yours because it's on the purple side. So I think I'm going to use my nice one over here. Fine. I didn't want you to use my phone anyways. Okay. Let me go over to the phone and let's see. Come on. Please pick up. Please pick up Titan speaker, man. Hello? Oh my gosh. Wait, I think the Titan speaker, man, actually picked up. Hey, a Titan speaker, man, I kind of need your help right now. Now, what do you need help with? Well, currently, it looks like some skibbity toilets are about to come attack our base, and we have no idea how to build defenses, so we're probably going to get, like, blown up or something. <sighs> that sounds like a lot of work for me to do. Well, it might be a lot of work, but what if I offer you a nice little reward of, let's say, a stack of diamonds? That's... I definitely love diamonds. Uh... I, I'll take you up on your offer. Oh, perfect. Okay, well, we're right aside a huge, like, G-Man right now, so you should have no trouble finding our base. Perfect. I'm on my way. Oh, my gosh. The way the tight speaker was actually going to come help us out. This is going to be so perfect. That is great news, but did I hear that you're paying him in diamonds? I'm not giving you any of my diamonds. Oh, don't worry, Zoe. You don't have to give me any of your diamonds because I already stole them from you. What? You stole my diamonds? Uh, yeah, I stole your diamonds, Zoe. Your diamonds are my diamonds. Hey, guys, I'm here. Oh, my gosh. It's looked speaker man's here whoa he's actually super weird looking but super weird looking zoe he's super strong and he's gonna help us defend our base don't be mean to him otherwise he's gonna leave yeah, that's rude well hopefully he stays but he's still weird looking oh my gosh whatever i'm sorry she's being so mean to you i don't really know what her problem is it's probably because she's weird looking yeah i kind of agree with you dex you can't talk about your girlfriend like that oh i'm sorry you weren't even supposed to hear me but guys come on we have to focus we have to start building some defenses and honestly we have no idea what to do so uh titan speaker man do you have any ideas i do uh it looks like you guys already tried grass blocks did that not work uh no grass blocks are like super super weak i put some tnt on it and the whole wall just blew up oh you must not have any good blocks then um i think a good one would to start off would be a lava moat definitely need one of those wait a lava moat so you mean like break around the grass and then we fill it with lava yep and then we have a bridge that retracts up and down to let us pass oh that would be a super good idea okay let's go ahead and start building out a few blocks like this and how deep should we make this lava moat like three blocks wide or something yeah three blocks are just enough to where they can't jump over it. Okay, I don't really know if toilets can jump, so we might be okay, but wait, what if there's something extra special ones that can jump like the spider one? So yeah, maybe we should just definitely do like three blocks. Definitely, and we should make it deep too. Oh, we should totally make it deep. And I'm gonna go ahead and grab a lava bucket. So while you guys are breaking that, I can start filling it in with a bunch of lava. I'm gonna race you, Titan Speaker Man. Let's do it. Come on, Zoe, you have to go faster. The Titan Speaker Man's already like halfway around. Are you serious? He's so fast. So you're missing like all the blocks. Oh my gosh, come on, I have to help you out. We can do this together. Hurry, Dax, we have to win. Both of you guys definitely can't beat me. And what the heck? He's already almost all the way around. And wait, he only did like one layer. He's not even done yet. Yeah, he's not even done. Don't worry. I'm going to catch up to you guys. Uh, you're totally not going to catch up because I'm going to use commands to just fill this all in with lava. Whoa, that's cheating. How's 
it cheating? There's no rule books. Anyways, I hired you. I can do whatever I want. I still haven't gotten paid. But yeah, you haven't gotten paid because they haven't attacked us yet. And we haven't won yet. I can't pay you for doing nothing. You don't, I don't get half now and half later? Why would you get half now? That doesn't even make sense, Titan Speaker, man. I'm already doing a lot of the work. Honestly, Dax, that kind of makes sense. But it makes sense. You want to pay him half now, Zoe? I think that's fair, even though he's weird looking. Oh my gosh. Okay, let me just go to my secret chest. And I mean, they're your diamonds after all, so I don't really care what happens to them. Wait, if it's my diamonds, give them to me. Okay, so let me go ahead and break out where my secret chest is in perfect okay i guess i could give you like half a stack of diamonds right now since they are zoe's and i don't really care about them perfect i'm on board what the heck dax why did you give him my diamonds whoa, 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 wait you don't have to pull it a diamond sword zoe we're on the same side you're right i don't need to pull it on you give me my diamonds no way i'm not gonna give you these diamonds these are mine this is a hard day's work zoe he has to help us out he has to keep those diamonds you can't take them back from him fine but you better be worth it oh i definitely will be and using these diamonds i just got a great idea we need a supply room where we can put like armor and swords and everything just in case they come through. Oh, wait a second. A supply room would actually be a really good idea. But uh, wait a second. We're even going to build it inside of this house. Obviously underground. Oh, wait, I guess underground is a smart idea. I didn't even think about that. What if we have like two different ladders going down on each one of our sides? That's a super good idea. And then I can make my side of the room purple. Oh, yeah, but I'm going to make my side of the room green. Blah. Green's like the worst color ever. Why would you want that? You guys should try using red. Red's really cool. Wait, why in the world would you use red? Because it's the best color, obviously. That's even worse, Titan Speaker Man. Yeah, I agree with Zoe. Red's a kind of ugly color. Yikes, I might have to increase my charge. You want more diamonds? Yeah, right. Hey, you guys are insulting me in the color red. The best color. You know what, Titan Speaker Man? What if I use a little bit of red right here? Instead of us actually breaking the blocks, what if I put down a piece of TNT and just blow it up? Well, that's smart. And see, look, it's made out of the color red, so you should like it. And oh gosh, wait, did it go into our roof? Oh my gosh, this is not good. Yeah, our own room's getting a little bit messed up. Come on, guys, we have to break it out as fast as we can. I'm going, I'm going. Okay, and perfect. Now we have everything basically filled out. But uh, what in the world is this in the middle? It looks like you're trying to build a pool or something. Maybe I'm trying to build a pool so we can relax in the middle of the battle. I mean, do you want a pool? Is that a good idea? Yep. Tide Speaker Man, what do you think? That kind of takes away from our, like, armor area, though. Sure, you guys are teaming up to go against me. That's not even fair. Wait, how in the world are we teaming up to go against you? I'm literally just saying it doesn't make that much sense if this is going to be an armory room. Whatever, we don't have to do the pool. It's fine. But you guys are going to be mad when we don't have one. I mean, I guess it's already, like, dug out. So you can add in a pool if you want. I can start building all the walls and stuff. Oh, and you can make the bottom out of the uh, the silverfish blocks. How about we fill our pool with fake water? That way, if somebody else tries to swim in it, they'll get injured. Wait a second. That's such a good idea. So if anyone breaks into our house and tries to come down here, they're just going to fall into our trap pool. Exactly. Okay, Zoe, while you start building out the trap pool, I guess I'm going to go ahead and get some lime blocks and I'll also get some purple blocks so we can separate the room. I'm going to start making the ladders. Okay, that's a pretty good idea. Let me go ahead and start carving out this so I can add in the green. And where's the middle? The middle's like right about here. So this is where we're going to split off the colors at. Okay, perfect. That side's all filled in with all of this lime concrete. And now I have to do the purple side. Perfect. Yes, do my side. Don't forget the red. Uh, There's no red anywhere inside of here. What if we just make like the wall back there out of red or like lava or something? That would look nice. Now we should definitely have all the walls be red. All the walls be red. I mean, I guess if you want them to be red, you can do that. No. How about we just make the ceiling red? Because the walls being red would just be so ugly. Yeah, I kind of agree with Zoe. Ugh, fine. Okay, is this the arbor's probably going to be all the way back here? Maybe we should make this a few blocks deeper. That's a good idea. Like, how does this look right here? Perfect. Looks really good. And I think what we do in order to separate this being the armor room is we make all of this floor out of lava and then color with glass. That way it actually looks really cool. That's going to look so awesome. Yeah, it'll probably scare people off. Exactly. If people get scared, they're not going to want to attack us and then they're not going to take our armor. Exactly. So let me go ahead and change all of this flooring out to be lava right here. And then I can set the upper floor to be glass. And perfect. Now it's all filled in. Doesn't this look pretty good? This is awesome. Yeah, it looks really good. But guys, we haven't even decided what we're going to do for the walls yet. What type of block should we even use on the walls? <clears throat> red blocks. <clears throat> uh, we're not using red blocks. We already discussed that that's an ugly color. And you already got the roof. Yeah, but I could get more. Yeah, I mean, I guess you could get more, but you're not going to get more. Zoe, do you have any good ideas? Um, Why don't you do lava walls? Lava walls? Huh, I guess we could do lava walls, but isn't that a little bit dangerous? No, not if you cover it with glass. Okay, I mean, I guess we can go ahead and make lava walls. So why don't I start carving out this side over here and then you guys can carve out that side in the back wall. Sounds good to me. Okay, guys, it's perfect. Look at this. Now we have lava surrounding us everywhere inside of this armor room. This actually looks really, really good. Exactly. It looks awesome. Okay, and perfect. Oh, it looks like you're already adding an armor stand. So now we can pick out what type of armor you want to use in this battle. Ooh, I want to use diamond armor. Ooh, you want to use diamond armor? Of course, because I'm super rich. Uh, Zoe, you're not rich. You literally just gave all of your last diamonds over to the Titan Speaker Man. I'm richer than you because you stole the diamonds from me. Well, I mean, I 
guess that's true. Whatever, Zoe. You don't have to be mean about it. I'm not being mean. I'm being factual. Well, if you're going to use diamond armor, let's see. What do I want to use? And oh, I think I'm going to use netherite armor because it's way stronger than diamond armor. Whatever, Dex. Netherite isn't even that strong. What? Netherite is like one of the strongest armors. And whoa, wait a second, tight speaker man. What are you putting on? An exosuit armor. Whoa, this looks super, super cool. Honestly, it looks cooler than both of our armor, Zoe. Sounds lame to me. Glad you stayed the obvious. Okay, perfect. Now that we have our armor added in, maybe we should head back to the surface and add in a few more defenses. Yep, let's do it. And uh, guys, it looks like it got a bit darker outside. This is not good. We need to work super fast. What should we do next? Uh, I don't know. I don't have any good ideas. Tight speaker, man, we hired you. What's the next thing we should do? Well, first, we definitely need to finish the bridge for the moat, because how are we supposed to get across? Oh, yeah, I guess we don't really have a way to get across. But what if we just use some cool blocks and then we have to like jump over them or something? That's a good idea, like parkour. Oh, exactly. And wait a second. What if we get like some bouncy castle blocks? Oh, that's a good idea. What are bouncy castle blocks? I've never heard of those. Okay, Zoe, well, let me go ahead and show you. So basically, we can put down one of these bouncy castle blocks like this. And as soon as you jump on them, you start to bounce up like this. That's awesome. I want to try. Yep. And if you want to go over, you have to make sure to get some momentum first. Otherwise, you won't make it. Woohoo! Ah! Yahoo! Yeah! Woohoo! That was so fun. Yeah. See, wasn't that so much fun, Zoe? And it's super easy to get across. I think that I could still probably fall in the lava, but... I'll try my best. Okay, guys. And wait, I kind of just thought of another good idea that we probably need for our base. What is it, Dax? Well, we probably need some type of wall all the way around our base. Otherwise, they could just like walk in. That is such a good idea. But what should we make the wall out of? Let's see. Are there any super strong blocks in here? And oh, wait a second. I have a great idea. What is it? What if we use some reinforced glass? Reinforced glass? Is that super strong? Yeah, look, Zoe. Okay, let me go ahead and place this down. And then you can go ahead and try to break it with like a piece of TNT or something. Okay. You want me to break it with TNT now? next to the lava? Uh, fine. Let me go ahead and put it a little bit further back. So if I put it right here and then I put a piece of TNT up and then light it off, it should break things around it, but the glass won't actually break. See, look at this. Wow, that was super strong. Okay, I believe you now. Yeah, and since it's glass, we can just see through, so it'll make everything super, super easy for us. Okay, guys, let's go ahead and fill all in this walls with a bunch of reinforced glass as fast as we can. We're already running out of time. Okay, we gotta hurry. Okay, I'm gonna go ahead and stack around this way. And Zoe, I'm already like beating you all the way around. You're so slow at this. Whatever, Dax. Not everything is a competition. Uh, yeah, everything literally is a competition. That's something a loser would say. Oh my gosh, I can't believe you just called me a loser. Well, yeah, I mean, you're going super slow. And look at this, me and the Titan Speaker Man are already like almost all the way around. Well, it's 2v1, that's not fair. Uh, actually, I think he started on your side, Zoe. Yeah, I had to help you. Whatever, I'm still gonna win this. I don't think you're gonna win this, because I'm already on your side helping you build the whole wall out. Oh, uh, you're helping me? That's so sweet. Uh, yeah, I'm helping you because you're super slow. And we're gonna get attacked while you're doing this. Oh my gosh, we're gonna get attacked regardless. I mean, yeah, but if we don't have a wall, it's gonna be really bad for us. But I think this looks pretty good for now. And wait a second, seeing this lava all around here kind of give me another idea. What is it, Dax? What if we get some netherrack and then we put it on top and then we light it with fire? That way no one would actually be able to go over the top. Otherwise, they'll just get burned. That's a good idea. And you should also put turrets up there. Oh, we could definitely use turrets. And wait, what if we put like the turrets outside of our house? That would probably be really smart. Yeah, inner and outer turrets. Exactly. Okay, first let's go ahead and build this huge wall of fire. And then we can go ahead and grab some turrets to put on our house. Okay, I already have the first row of netherrack down. Now I can just go back and fill it in with a bunch of fire and there's gonna be no way those ones can get over this if they try they're gonna get like totally burned okay and now that all the netherrack is basically placed let's just go back over it and we'll add it in a bunch of fire and then we can add in those lasers we talked about sweet there's no way they're gonna be able to get in with that and it looks like you already built some paths where our turrets can actually go so let me go ahead and get the base of the turrets and then i can get the top piece which i think we should use like laser guns yeah that or bazookas oh that or bazookas what if we do a couple of both that's gonna be so cool okay perfect let me go ahead and power this thing up and once it starts moving means it should be pretty much activated and then we can test it out. Ooh, what are we going to test it out with? Let's see. What's a school mob that we could get in? Whoa, what if we just grab like a skeleton? That'd be kind of funny to see. Yeah, that would be so funny. Okay, so let me go ahead and spawn the skeleton right down here and let's see what this thing ends up doing to it. And oh my gosh, that rocket just completely took it out. That was so deadly. This is awesome. What if I spawn in a few of these skeletons? Can it take out like all of them at once? And whoa, it took out like four of them. Okay, that was actually pretty pretty good. And now this one over here is going to get completely destroyed. And yeah, that guy totally got destroyed. So that was the bazooka. Why don't we test out the laser? Oh yeah, I guess we can go ahead and try the laser as well. So let me go ahead and put a laser gun over here. I'll just smack the laser all like this along with one of those energy cores. And then I guess I can spot in some more skeletons. And whoa, look at that. 
that. That is awesome. I don't know which one's cooler. Yeah, honestly, I don't know which one is cooler either. But yeah, let's go ahead and add a few of these around our base. Don't forget the inside. Okay, let's go ahead and stack some of them on the edges like this for the inside of our base. I can put one on each of the corners. I think that's good enough. And perfect. That looks super, super secure. It's going to be really hard for any of those mobs to get inside of here. Yeah, that looks super awesome. But do you think that we should make our house out of stronger material? Oh, yeah, maybe we should make our house out of stronger material. I mean, it is just dirt after all. Yeah, that's not very strong at all. Yeah, I mean, our house is just made out of wood after all, so I guess it's not really that strong. That's exactly what I was thinking. So what if we get some more reinforced blocks? Since those are basically some of the strongest blocks of the game. We could do that. Oh, maybe we can make all the floor over here out of reinforced lime wool. Since that is like the best color ever. Why don't we do half the floor with reinforced lime wool and then the other half with reinforced purple wool? Oh, I mean, I guess that's a good idea. Okay, I'll go ahead and do half of my side out of the reinforced lime wool, and I guess you can use that purple on that side. Sounds good to me. And actually, while you're also doing that, I'm gonna go ahead and replace the outside of this too because we probably need this basically everywhere yeah that's true and then i also think i'm gonna change out all of these oak planks over here to be reinforced lime concrete we need this base to be as strong as possible and oh look at this way we can even add in reinforced lime glass doesn't this look so cool it would be super cool if it was reinforced purple glass i mean i guess you could do that on your side but i'm not using that ugly color on my side it's not ugly dax it's like the best color ever well whatever then just use it on your side don't put it on my side okay i'm basically almost done making out the roof and oh wait a second tight speaker bear where did you even go i'm outside over here i had a pretty good idea for defending the front oh you have a good idea for defending the front well what are you doing and why are there fences here because i'm gonna spawn in some golems to defend our base and then i'm gonna attach a lasso onto them onto these fences so they won't leave oh wait a second that's actually a pretty good idea so it's basically like we have pet golems exactly okay that is a pretty good idea i guess you can keep doing that and i'm gonna keep finishing up our house sounds good and perfect so it looks like our house is basically made with all this reinforced stuff this actually looks really really good yeah our house looks even cooler than before we were getting attacked yeah i totally agree with you and wait a second this fire is actually giving me another really cool idea what is it dax what if we add like some dispensers here that shoot fireballs fireballs that sounds awesome okay so what if we go ahead and bring out this final row of glass up here and then we can grab ourselves some dispensers but we're gonna be careful otherwise we're gonna hit our snow golems and they'll probably get really mad at us yeah that wouldn't be good but then after we place down the dispensers we can just grab some fireballs and fill them all in with a ton of them that's gonna be so awesome Okay, now all these dispensers are here. Let me go ahead and run a bunch of redstone into all of them. And then we're going to need like a button to flick in order to light them all up. Ooh, can I push the button? Zoe, we don't even have a button yet. What are you even talking about? I just want to push the button. I mean, I guess you can whenever we get the button, but we don't have one right now. So why don't you put a fancy button somewhere? Okay, let me find a button. Okay, now that we have these two buttons here, let's go ahead and flick them and see if it works. And oh my gosh, look at all the fireballs it's shooting. That's awesome. This is like my favorite thing we've done yet. Whoa, this is going to be so destructive but oh uh, wait a second it actually hit the g-man do you think they're gonna get mad at us so what if they do they're already gonna attack us yeah i guess then we're okay okay and maybe for another layer of defense what we can do is put down some sand and then stack up like a bunch of cactuses on top that's a good idea let's mix it with the soul sand too so they go really slow oh wait that's such a good idea so why don't we go ahead and put down some sand right here and then we can put some soul sand next to it and then we can cover this whole area with it mm -hmm. okay and perfect this is looking pretty good now we just have to fill it in a bunch of cactuses and a bunch of random spots and then after we filling all the cactuses i guess we can just stack them up really, really high to make it really difficult for them to get through. Okay, just a few more blocks, and then I guess we could probably make them super tall after this. How many blocks high should we even make them? Do you guys think like two blocks or three blocks or maybe even four blocks? Probably three or four. Ooh, three or four sounds like a good idea. How about we stack them up 50 blocks high? Uh, 50 blocks might be a little bit too high, Zoe. I don't even know if that'd work. Why not? How would they get through it if it's 50 blocks high? I mean, I guess I could at least try it out. Oh gosh, this is gonna be really bad. Let me go ahead and type in a stack command and oh my gosh, look how big the cactuses are. This is perfect. Exactly like how I imagined. What in the world? This is literally ridiculous and I can't believe it actually worked. This is so cool. We have to keep it like this. Yeah, I mean, I guess we can just keep it like this. It's not hurting us or anything. It only makes it harder for them to get through. Exactly. That's a good idea, Zoe. Thanks. Yeah, we should end in, you know, just inside here, we have a severe lack of guards. We should definitely have some walls in here or something cool like that. Ooh, doggies. Yeah, dogs would actually be super cool. So what if we build them out like a little pen over here and we can cover it with some fences and then once we're getting attacked we can like let the fences go that's gonna be perfect can i name my dog uh yeah i mean i guess you can name your dog whatever you want perfect mr doggy it is 
You're going to name your dog Mr. Doggy. That's like the worst name ever. It's like the best name ever, Dax. What do you know? Uh, I think that's kind of a lame name. I mean, it's already called a dog. So why would you name it Mr. Doggy? Because his name is Mr. Doggy. Uh, okay, whatever, Zoe. Do what you want to do, I guess. And I will. What about Chewy? You can name your dog Chewy, but I'm going to name my dog Mr. Doggy. Okay. Okay, and while you guys are arguing about whatever dog name, I guess I'm going to be the one that has to do the redstone since neither one of you know how to do it. What the heck, Dax? I know how to do redstone. Wait, Zoe, if you know how to do redstone, then how do I connect this? Don't ask me so many questions right now. I'm busy. Yeah, see, you don't know anything about redstone. All you have to do is connect it with some redstone wire. And actually, we probably need like a little lever. So why don't I put a lever right outside this pen? That sounds perfect. You should do a uh, pressure plate. Let me go ahead and put down the lever here. And once I flick it, yes, perfect. Look at that. And oh gosh, guys, there's a lot of dogs outside of this. We're going to have to pick them up and put them back in their pen. Okay, we can do that easy peasy. All you got to do is grab them. I'm actually going to put this one all the way up there. And now we can keep doing more of them. And wait a second. There's some like baby wolves in here. Why are they in here? We don't need them. It's the next generation. The next generation. We don't need them. They're so weak. I'm going to take a sword. Just beat them up. Whoa. Beat them up. Yeah, we don't need any of these guys. Get out of here, you stupid puppy dogs. What's the matter with you, Dax? They're super weak, Zoe, and they can't help us out. Get them, guys. Don't kill the kids. We can at least keep them as pets. Well, yeah, but if we keep them as pets and then the walls drop, they're going to get all hurt during the fight. So it's like, this is a better option. They could be our motivation to work super hard so they don't kill our pets. Uh, fine, whatever. I guess, let's see. Are there any other baby wolves in here? And yeah, there's one back here. We'll just leave this guy here. Oh, he's so cute. And actually, before the time runs out, maybe we should add a few more things to the arm room, like some weapons and like a shield and stuff. Let's do it. So let me go ahead and put a double chest on this side. In the first row inside of this, I'm going to fill up with a sword and whoa, we have a bunch of swords and whoa, what even says an emerald sword? An emerald sword? That's awesome. Uh, yeah, and it's green, Zoe. So it's obviously going to be my sword. Yeah, it would be a lot better if it was purple. Well, too bad there's no purple swords because purple's super weak and the swords are even weaker. Are you serious? There's not a purple sword at all? Uh, no, I don't see any type of purple swords and uh titan speaker man why are there so many dogs down here and they're falling in the water no the fake water oh my gosh all the wolves are dying now you gotta go back up there what in the world is wrong with you those are super cool pets and now they're all getting hurt oh no my wolves get them back up here oh my gosh titan speaker man you have to make them all sit otherwise they're just gonna follow you everywhere but then they won't attack well yeah but then you can make them sit up whenever we're actually getting attacked but then they'll teleport okay fine then how about you just stay here in the dog pen while zoe and i finish up the armory room Sounds good. Okay, Zoe, and I actually thought of one more thing we're probably gonna need to do just in case things actually go kind of bad. What is it, Dax? Just in case things go bad, what if we make like a little tunnel that shows us a huge explosion that completely blows up the toilet? Wait, are you talking about like a self-destruct button and then an escape route? Yeah, basically we're gonna have a self-destruct button. I'm thinking for the self-destruct button, we put it like right underneath the toilet. That is such a good idea. Do you think you could dig all the way over there? Okay, let me go ahead and dig up and see it. Oh my gosh, Zoe, look at this. We're right underneath the toilet. Really? Let me look. Yeah. It's basically right there. And now that we can actually see it, we should probably fill up a lot of this with a bunch of TNT. Okay, but what TNT should we use? Mm, let's see. What TNT we should we use? And whoa, there's one that says TNT times 10. This looks super, super strong. Okay, let me go ahead and fill a bunch of this up with TNT. And then I guess we can run redstone all the way back. And uh, Zoe, while I'm doing this, can you make like a little escape route or something? Sure, I can do that. Okay, let me go ahead and get all of this redstone wire all the way back here. And then I can place on a super big button that no one can press. Otherwise, everything's gonna blow up and that's gonna be really bad for us. Okay, let me go ahead and put a button like right over here. It perfect. Now when anyone presses that, all this TNT is just gonna light off. Okay, and basically for this escape route, I'm thinking we have it go up to like a super safe layer so we can watch all the explosions. That's gonna be super cool. Okay, so for that, let's go ahead and get some more reinforced glass. It's basically nothing can break that. All I have to do is make a, a floor like this, and then I guess we could stack it like uh five blocks deep. That sounds pretty good. And then we can just make the walls out of the same thing, and then nothing will be able to break this. Okay, and this looks pretty cool. Well, let me go ahead and also get some mine carts with a chest. That way, when we actually have to escape, we can just grab them and go. And uh, guys, do you see that stuff all the way across the cactuses? Oh no, are they starting to attack us? Yep, they're coming. Oh gosh, yeah, the skinny toilets are here. Quick, we have to go to the arm room and grab all of our stuff as fast as possible. We have to hurry. Okay, let me go ahead and grab my super cool netherite armor since it is the strongest armor after all. Okay, I have to grab my diamond armor. Yeah, I'm getting my super cool space armor. Okay, now I have all of this on. Let me go inside the chest and grab my super super cool emerald sword and whoa i can also grab a bunch of whoa and i can also grab a bunch of super cool enchanted golden apples though you should probably grab one too yeah i'm grabbing one too and actually i'm gonna steal one of your bows and arrows is that okay of course it's okay guys i got something better than bows and arrows if you want them uh what do you have and what the heck is that is that a machine gun and I got myself a minigun. What in the world? Where did you even get these things at? I come prepared. Whoa, that's actually super cool. Okay, guys, let's all get up to the top of the base so we can actually defend this. Dex, I am so glad that you hired this guy. Yeah, I told you.
know he's super good. And whoa, guys, there's so many escape the toilets outside. Come on, we have to fight them all off. Wait, this shoots arrows? That's so cool. Mine shoots like explosions. What? It go whoa, wait, it looks like it's shooting lasers and stuff. Yep, it's like shooting lightning. It's so cool. Okay, I'm also gonna go ahead and break all these snowmen out of their thing so they can go fight. Come on, come on. And oh gosh, guys, they're getting so close. What in the world is going on? Whoa, they're right here. Are the cactus not working? Uh, it looks like they're working a little bit. And ow, my thing just shot me with a rocket launcher. Oh, stuff's hurting me. A rocket launcher? Are you kidding? Yeah, our little laser turret keeps hitting me with rockets. Stop hitting me. Oh my gosh, I'm getting attacked. Guys, we might want to fall back. Yeah, we might want to fall back to the place. Quick, everyone get inside. Go, go, go. Oh gosh, guys, wait a second. They took out our huge cactus wall. Yeah, they destroyed it. I'm going to release the hounds. Yeah, go ahead and release all the dogs. Come on, guys. I'm going to go ahead and hit this button and shoot a bunch of fire at them. Dax, there's one in our house. Wait, there's one in our house. Oh gosh, come on, Zoe. We can beat him up. I've got him. Come on, Zoe. And perfect. We'll take that guy out. Come on, let's take all these guys out in the front. Sweet. The lava took him out. Okay, I think we can go back over and take out the last few of these guys. We have to help out our snowmen. Come on, doggies. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, wait, there's only a few left, and our snowmen are actually doing super good. That was a genius idea, Titan Speaker Man. Yep, I knew it was a good idea. Wait, I thought that was my idea. Uh, was it your idea, Zoe? Definitely not. What are you even talking about, Titan Speaker Man? That was my idea. Why are you taking credit for my stuff? What are you talking about? It was definitely my idea. We can agree to disagree. Okay, guys, it looks like we actually took out the first wave, so maybe we're all protected and stuff. It really doesn't matter who had all these snow golems there, because it looks like we survived. Woohoo! Yeah, we definitely did. And, oh, uh, wait a second, guys. Where did all these G-Men just come from? No, did you say G-Men? Yeah, there's a bunch of G-Men out here, and oh gosh, I can't even see. Quick, let me shoot my little arrow gun at all of them. I'll help you, Dax. Come on, come on, and oh no, this isn't good. The G-Men's like the strongest skimmy character. How are we even gonna take this guy out? We could do it easy. We took out the last wave. Yeah, I guess we did, but oh no, it looks like our snow golems are all getting beat up, guys. Seriously? Those guys were like super strong. Yeah, this isn't good. Yeah, this isn't good at all, but come on, we have to try and fight and defend our base. Guys, I'm being jumped. Oh gosh, wait, Zoe, where even are you? I can't even get through all these cactuses. I'm in the center of a giant pile. Oh gosh, you're gonna have to run out of there somehow, Zoe. I'm going. Oh my gosh, guys, and even more of them spawned in. This is not good. Titan Speaker Man, what are we gonna do? I don't think we can beat them all. There's a ton, we need to back off. Yeah, okay, guys, everyone get back to the house quick. Whoa, they pushed me into the lava. Release the hounds. Oh, wait a second, guys. It looks like they took all the fire too, guys. I think we have to get out of here. There's no way we can beat them. Okay, let's go. Quick, everyone get inside our little armory room and you both can get inside the mine carts. I'll be the one to press the button. Okay, we have to run. Okay, go ahead. So we get out of here. Get out of here, Titan Speaker. And I'll press the button once you guys are out of here. I'm going. Okay, let me go hit the button. I'm right behind you guys. Come on, come on. We have to go. Hurry, hurry before everything blows up. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, guys, come on. We love the TNT. Everything's gonna blow up. And whoa, wait, why is everything getting so laggy right now? Whoa. And oh my gosh, guys, look at all the destruction everywhere. Oh my gosh, is our house okay? Uh, I mean, it looks like our house is actually kind of okay because we used a bunch of reinforced stuff. Seriously? That's awesome. Yeah, and look at that. It looks like the whole toilet got blown up, guys. I think we won. No way. We never win. Sweet. Awesome. We definitely won. Now, Dax, can I get the other half of my diamonds? And that was a super crazy video. If you guys want to watch another, make sure to click the video on screen. Bye, guys.